people praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Sister Gostein Morris. I joined Choosing in the year 2014 in River State, but I'm staying in Biesta State now. Choosing praise the Lord. You are staying in Biesta State now. Yes. Now. Yes, sir. Aren't you so lucky that the governor of Biesta State is in this is in this program? Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want to return the glory to this God of choosing for what he has done for me. I was in someone's house in 19 years and a half without paying my diary. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. It happened, I am the last born of my family. In my, my elder sister died without paying diary. All my sisters, they just did in someone's house without paying diary. Even the men, they just picked Somebody children without paying that. I don't know that it's foundation power that's speaking. I don't want to go long. It it happened. Someone speak in my life last year. Our pastor, our pastor, pray for me. Say from today I break that yoke. Go and marry. It happened as immediately I come back. I tell my husband before a no God of choosing proof his power. Choosing praise the Lord. Last. Two months ago, on feet, that young was brave. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So I want to return the glory to God of choosing that have done this for me. As me, I was a last born. God of choosing picked me up on that family and he break that covenant. Hmm. I return all the glory to this God of choosing that have done this for me in Jesus' name. Amen. In this junction, I pray for my Jew heaven and last, all the choosing worldwide. Even at last in Jesus' name. Amen. Clap unto this great God again. I appreciate him. Thank you, Father. Thank you very, very much. We are drawing close, very close to the time of power. We will not be longer. Pastor will be coming. After this testifier, we are going to take our first offering in today's program. Remember, in our programs, we normally take two offerings. We give you sufficient notice because this is a a church where offering is not also taken anyhow. You will hear the pastor. Every fellowship, and that they say it, I want to be challenged. The only church I've been to some churches before I came to chosen. Where this is the only church that I know. The pastor in every message, he will say if the source of your money is evil. Is prostitution is criminal. Don't give offering in this church. Consistently, since the beginning, to yesterday, he said it. I am sure he will say it again today. But prepare for your offering. The first offering in today's program. The next testifier. Prepare for your offering. Your tithe, your seed of faith. We are going to offer to the Lord now. The next testifier. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Brother Victor Kejoku. I am from Imo State, Okigwe local government area. I am here to appreciate the God of choosing for what he has done for me. And for that reason, I said I will definitely come and testify to the whole world to know what the God of choosing can do. I call the God of choosing the God of all impossibility. Because the God of choosing did something that no other man or God can do for me. I was arrested for what I know nothing about for the past 2013 stroke 2020. And I was taken to prison for the crime I know nothing about 2016. The judgment was passed because there was an evidence to prove that indeed I committed such crime. But before God... I am innocent of the crime. So when they passed the judgment, the judgment was stated dead by hanging hmm. in 2016. On you? Yes, sir. When they passed that judgment dead by hanging, I was remained at Chirikiri Medium Security Prison. When they took me there, two days later, they took me to Maximum Prison. Hmm. When they took me to Maximum, I was in prison because nobody came to me. Nobody came. After like two weeks time that has been condemned, I called my elder brother, brother Chibike. I said, brother, please, now I have been condemned. And the 
the problem I am passing here is how to feed. Can you help me please and send me small money to feed? And my brother called me, Abumneme, I say sir. Abumneme, I say sir. He said, nine minus one is how many? I say brother, it's eight. He said, nine minus one is how many? I say eight. He said, from the day you were condemned, we have minused you from the family. Mm, mm, mm. When my brother passed that statement to me, I tried to call my father, but there is no way. I tried to call my mother, there is no way. I looked up, I looked down. But the worst part of it is that I wasn't a Christian before I went to prison. I was a pagan from Aaron Dizwag and then Joko Uno. So when I was in the prison, all hope was lost. I tried to squeeze out time in order to meditate to get somebody I will call to meet my Harvard list in Anambra State. And the number was given to me. I called him. And his name is Abba Rwangene. When I called him, I told him the situation I am into. He told me I should send money so that they will buy a ram. When the ram is buried, I will be out of prison. And the money was sent after the crucifixion, yet I was still in prison. I called my uncle, Masi Periko Mokoye. He promised me he will come to visit me in prison, which he did so. When he came, he promised me seven days I will be out. Yet the seven days passed, nothing happened. Mm. I looked up, I looked down. All hope was lost. I was in prison. Suddenly something happened. <laughs> A sister from the Lord choosing, they always visit the prison, always. Many churches are coming to the prison. When they are coming, they are bringing food items, they are bringing clothes, they are bringing everything. But the reason why I am going to the church in prison was because of the food items they are bringing so that I can see something to eat. But the sister came to Lord choosing that day. They did not bring any food, but I came because I thought they would bring food. When I was sitting close to the sister and the sister started saying, there is nothing that God of choosing cannot do. When the sister said that, I was shocked. After he attended to the first person, I was CC. I was privileged to go to anybody. I rushed to the sister. I touched her. I said, sister, please, I am here in condemn. And the sister said, what is my offense? I told him everything. And the sister told me, if truly I am innocent of this crime, the God of choosing will bring me out. That's hey! how where I am. Power! Hey, hey. And when the sister told me this I was like I have tested the God I know But yet they did not do anything mm. If your God can do this I will serve your God the rest of my life hmm. And the sister collected my name I told him my name He said no I will pray with you and I will change your name The sister prayed with me And gave me a name called Victor Hmm. I started bearing that name, the sister go. And the sister gave me her number secretly. I started calling the sister in the welfare. She started praying with me. Suddenly the sister called and said, you want to talk to me? And the sister said, I should watch. The God of choosing is about to do something now. Uh, action God. <laughs> action God. <laughs> and wow. immediately she went to the camp. When she went to the camp, suddenly... The DCP of our prison now came and announced that we should be praying hard. The governor will visit the prison anytime, any day. The way we are praying, the governor will do something. Hmm. And when the DCP told us this, the sister now came that the same day with a flyer like this. And our daddy, that the Lazarus Boca, that was a flyer, he placed his hand like this. And I joined my hand together with that his hand. I pass a decree. I say, if truly the God of choosing is alive, let that God remember me now. Hmm. And after doing that, the governor visited the prison. The former, I'm talking about the former governor of Lagos State, His Excellency, the former governor of Lagos State, that ruled one tenor. When he, Ambode, when he visited the prison, I was opportune for the people he pardoned from condemned to life. Power! Hey! God of power! 
God has chosen Oti Mete Power. God of Moka Oti Mete. Clap unto this great God. He answers prayers. He is alive. Thank you, Father. And when I called Sister Lillian, I told Sister Lillian, indeed, the God of choosing have started indeed. Hmm. I have been pardoned from condemned to life. Sister Lillian laughed and told me, this is just the beginning as you watch and see what the God will do. Hey! Suddenly, we enter into 2020 and the present governor of Lagos State now visited the prison second time. And when he was attending to people he wants to pardon, I was also among the people he pardoned. Power! Hey, hey, hey. It's the finger of God. Thank you, Lord. It's not ordinary. And when the governor pardoned me, remember, my family forgot about me because they have my nose to me. And the sister told me I should not tell anybody what the God of choosing is doing until the God of choosing will finish it. Hmm. Suddenly, then now, when I was pardoned from life imprisonment to awaiting trial, the sister said I should watch and see in this week that she is going to mountain, in this week that it will make sure that my name came out for people that will go to court. Suddenly, my name came out to people that will go to court in January this year. January this year? Yes. And that January this year, they said I will go to court. The day I came out for court, they said they will not carry court that day. I went back. I called the sister. I told the sister. Sister said I should don't worry. That the God of choosing will go to that court and do something. I should don't worry. Hmm. I sit. When I was there, suddenly, February, they said COVID-19 has taken place. They shot everywhere down. I still called the sister. The sister said I should not worry. That I will come out. That he's beating his chest that the God of Jesus will not be at rest until I come out. Hey! And suddenly, after the COVID-19, I was in the cell and the DCP came and announced that those people that has been in prison for almost seven to eight years now, the president has given order they should release you. Hey! Hey! hey, hey. He answers prayer. He answers prayer. He answers prayer. Oh. God of chosen answers prayer. Oh. God of chosen answers prayer. Oh. Amen. When the now came to the cell that I was, they passed an announcement. They said, listen to your name for the people the, God, the president has pardoned. Hey. I was the first person they mentioned. Power! Hey, hey, hey. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of choosing. The God of the moment, the real equipment, that's the God of the chosen. The God of the pastor of chosen. Fear him. Reference him. Clap unto him. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of chosen. Thank you, Lord. And they said they will take us to court before they will finally let us go. When they took us to court at Ikeja Court 4, and the name of the judge was Justice Mwaka. When they took us to the court, the judge now asked me, how many years have you spent in prison? I told the judge, this is my seven years and nine months in prison. And the judge said, what have you achieved for that seven years and nine months? I told the judge, I have achieved salvation. One. Secondly, before I went to prison, I cannot read or write. But today, I have a song I have written in the prison. And also, I have a book I have written in the prison. By the special grace of God, with the help of people, I will publish the song and the books. And the judge said to me, By the power bestowed on me, I hereby discharge and acquit you. Hey! Hey, hey, hey! Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Chosen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. I have an advice for everybody in this place, both the choosing one and those that visited the choosing. The advice is this. If you are here, you are putting your trust in man. Man will fail you. 
If you are putting your trust in connection, connection will fail you. If you are putting your trust in power, power will fail you. Hmm. If connection can save, advance will not be in the prison today with me. A power can save, the former governor of Abia State will not be in the prison with me. The only thing that can save is the God of choosing. Hmm. That is why I am here to pray for our daddy that have sent his people, that have sent the chosen member to come and visit me in prison. I will go on my knee to pray for our daddy. Hmm. And before I pray for our daddy, my uncles, all of them denied me, both my father and my mother, because I was condemned. I sang this song for them, and this is the song. Obunye kekurumanumo Obunye kagua nakamo diotao Enu walele Enu wanakamo diotano Manenu wekwekekwe I pray for our daddy. Daddy, in the name of Jesus, Daddy, the Lord that have assigned you for this mission, that God will keep on equipping you with power and long life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Your enemy will never see you. They will submit to your authority. Amen. Daddy, from today, from today, I pray, anything you open your mouth to speak, heaven will ordain it. Amen. And any spirit you cast out, that spirit will never come back again. Amen. From today, daddy, at the end, you will be with our Lord Jesus in the paradise. Amen. And every member of the Lord choosing, God bless you all. Amen. I want you to listen before you go. Are you listening? I have received a message from the sister that you was coming to the prison, I was praying for you. And she said that I should tell you and the congregation that the mountain she was going to is in Woody headquarters of the Lord's choosing. It's choosing programs, that those are the mountains she was going to. So that nobody will live here and begin to look for one mountain or the other. The mountain is here now. It's choosing crusades. As you make your petition, the God of the choosing will answer you automatically. I want to ask you, is there power in choosing? Condemned to death. And there are other gods and everything tried to no avail. But God of chosen has set him completely free. We don't know your case. We'll continue to say it. Whether health, business, career, politics, whatever, in this place today, every enemy in your way will be crushed and you will enter into dominion in Jesus' name. Clap unto God and appreciate Him. Clap unto the God of the choosing. We are going to rise up to give our offering now. I, I love that statement from the pastor of the church. Every day when I remember it, my faith grows. I made that statement yesterday. The pastor says when he preaches, he says if the preaching word of God is just to come and preach, just to preach and preach the word of God, and there is no power accompanying it, he says he's not there, he's not part of it. He says, count me out. He said, when he preaches, you will see the power. You will experience the power. That's why he's in the business of preaching the word of God. And today, you will experience that power in Jesus' name. Rise up with your offering now. Rise up your offering, your tithe, your seed of faith. Everything that you want to use to bless the name of this God. Everything. Including what you might think in your heart and said, I didn't know that God is like this.